my name is Ingvar Renningen. We're here at Lake Natoma at the NCAA Championships. Alright, bears on three, ready, one, two, three, bears! Well, every boat uh, rode really hard, and if any boat would have finished a place lower, you know, we wouldn't have finished second. So it was a complete team effort. It was also just really hard rowing, really good racing today. So I think the team really did a good job today. All the boats um, had good quality races. We did as good as we could have done, um, both in the four, the JV, and the varsity eight. We did what we knew that we could, and after two hard days of racing yesterday and the day before, I really think we stepped up um, and did what we're capable of, and we showed how good Golden Bears can be. So I think this morning was the best race that I've ever been in. It was definitely the closest, the toughest, the most exciting, and the closest I've ever been to winning a national championship. So this morning, put the cherry on top. You guys are like the most down second place team here. <laughs> well, you're the only team. But there are definitely 20 teams that would trade places with you in a heartbeat. Right? So, really good job today. Really good job, everyone. The team did a great job. You know, there was, uh, I think they had their best races as their last race, and that's what you can hope for. Um, I'm crying because I can't believe it's over. And I'm so thankful that all of you have been here, especially the last year. Um, I'm going to miss you guys so much. And I love you all. I know you're gonna kill it even though we won't be here the next years. Um, and Calgary is really something special. It's something that I don't think any other teams that are here right now have. Um, I'm gonna be a Golden Bear forever. So thank you and thank you to the coaches. I thought this season was great. Um, I think one key to our success this year, which made us really good throughout the three months that we had season, was that we not only focused on the outcomes, like we didn't only focus on the results, we focused on the journey and enjoying the journey as well. And that's something I really appreciate we did, we did because it's my last season. Um, so it's been so much fun. I have so many memories. Um, I wouldn't have done it any other way. It's bittersweet. I mean, this is my eighth year on the rowing team. So it can be sad I'm not costing that vote again, but at the same time, there's two seniors graduating from that boat, so there's seven returners and most of them are young. There's three sophomores, two freshmen, so they're gonna rock it next year. Seniors have been amazing. The transition was a, it was a pretty big one. This was a program that had a, a ton of success before I got here, which is pretty rare for, for a, a new coach to come into a program that's already uh, as successful as it is. So um, I relied a lot on the seniors for, for leadership and I needed to learn a lot from them and I did learn a lot from them um, and the result is, is what you saw today. In second place is the University of California with a final time of 618.608. Alright, your second place team with 114 points is the University of California. Head coach Al Acosta. Hi, my name is Lindsay Meltz. I'm a senior coxswain on the women's rowing team. Thanks for joining us at the NCAA Women's Rowing Championships in Gold River, California. Go Bears!